Happy to have you with us for NBA Basketball on 2K Sports. With Grant Hill and Chris Weber. I'm Brian Anderson. Allie LaForce will be joining us as well. And taking a broader look here at the year-over-year -year scoring trend for Jason Tatum. And one thing he's gotten better at as the years have gone on is scoring the ball, shouldering a bigger load of the offense, and being willing to accept the responsibility of a go-to option for this team. And let's go straight over to the sideline for a report before they tip off. Hey, Allie. Jason Tatum already an all-star, but he won't rest until he's a superstar. He said, quote, nobody puts higher expectations on me than myself. When I have big games, I try not to get too excited because the guys I look up to, they do it often. I want to get to the point where when I do it, it's kind of like another night. Brian? All right, Allie, thanks. And Grant, you look at these rosters. A lot of talent in the backcourt. Oh, a sign of the times, B.A. Agility and skill is in demand, and that is on display tonight. And let's take a look at Boston's starting lineup. Smart and Brown, a great defensive backcourt. Al Horford out there with Jason Tatum. And it's Williams in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And for the Warriors, the Splash Brothers, Curry and Thompson, the guards. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Draymond Green. And it's Thompson in at the three. It'll be the Celtics off the tip. Smart against Curry. Down low. Here's Horford. Perfect pass to oh, set up the lay-in. Oh, and Horford can turn it up. I mean, just setting some teeth rattling screens and then insult to injury, rolling in for the buck. Curry passes to Thompson. And out of bounds. Um, Boston will have it. Boston ball. And here's Boston. Smart passes to Brown. Horford, a screen on Poole. Pass to Tatum. Back to Brown. That three's off the mark. To the middle. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt. About a minute played here so far in the first. Tatum finds Smart. Brown against Curry. Six on the shot clock. Curry with a steal. Wiggins right side. It's Poole on the wing. Green with a screen on Tatum. Outside for Green. Let's it go from deep. The rebound by Jason Tatum. Yeah, B.A., and, and you know, everybody wants to compare everybody. Tatum's like Cole, or Tatum's like Paul Pierce. But you watch Tatum, he's carved out a niche of his own. <laughs> I tell you, a little extra pressure on D when you're up against a point guard who can elevate. Ha, it doesn't make it easy, does it? And guys, it's clear, though, he enjoys showing off his athleticism. The D can't give him these opportunities. Pass to Brown. Now Tatum. Smart outside. And here's Brown. And they're going to count that bucket, and they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. And the unique blend of size and skill makes Tatum difficult to match up with, Chris. Bigger defenders can't mirror him. Smaller defenders can't alter his shot. And he's still at the beginning stages of his development. Breakout offensively, it could be a surprise to some, but not to me. But it's the end result of continuous gains to the shot making arsenal. Pass to Thompson over Tatum. That's short off the rim. His interior scoring is one of the things that drives their offense. Don't expect him to miss many of those. Smart passes to Brown with the floater. That one won't fall. He's one for three on the day. The Warriors trailing. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. 
Oh, they need this. And that one's good. Cool. And you watch teams try to defend Brown. See, Webb, they're not exactly sure what to take away. Can't go under screens. He's too good of a shooter now. You play him tight, that triggers the drive. You're playing him physical, sends him to the line, Webb. He's improved as well. Personal foul. Second team foul. And in the first quarter, about three minutes played. Outside Tatum. On the take. Oh, the ability to contest shots without fouling. Draymond gets better at it every year. Cool outside. From deep three-point range. And it's Stephen Curry with the three. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. Boston, no good that time either. Golden State has gone only one of four from three-point land. Green, the pass to Wiggins. Fires from deep. And there's Curry on the assist by Wiggins. Curry's got his second bucket on the night. If you do it better than Curry, the range of his shooting is practically in a league of his own. Here's Tatum. Oh, what a play. It's snatched out of the air. Credit the block. Wiggins passes to Green. Smart against Curry. Pass to Thompson. Launches it. Boston with a rebound. And here's Smart. He played a great game against Golden State. Outside, Brown. Drives to the hoop. Oh, no good again that time to the paint. Here's Curry. Ooh, he's looking comfortable now. Three for three. Yeah, you can't Curry inside. Looks he's way too consistent in close run. Time called here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. And deep into the season now, Grant, are you noticing any trends that may just become a permanent part of the game? Well, I mean, of course, B.A., the fast pace of the NBA is here to stay. And players of all positions are continuing to develop deeper range from the three-point line. Big impact on defense as we take a look at the Steel's leaders so far this season. Fifth on the list, Marcus Smart. Yeah, he's a pest. He gets under your skin. I mean, all these players have the combination of quickness and intelligence you want in a point guard. It's not just their quickness or their hands that has them on the top of the list. It's their defensive instinct that sets them apart. Horford outside. Brown finds Smart. Outside Tatum. Will it go? Unable to get that one. And Golden State will go the other way with it. Still plenty of time for him to contribute in this game, but it's a tough stretch he's going through. Curry, no good. Boston's gone 0 for 3 from downtown. Brown passes to Smart. Here's Tatum. Outside, Brown. The kick to Tatum. Shot clock at five. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. 
That's his first pitch. Love how Tatum commits to his shots. The foul won't stop him from putting it up. At the line for the Celtics, Jason Tatum. At the line for two. Falls for Tatum. The future that Tatum has in this league is so bright. I mean, he's proven to have a great work ethic and, and desire to keep improving. Kaminga, he's checked in for Poole. And so Tatum nails both of them. And it's the Warriors with the ball. A tough loss coming against Boston in their last game. Yeah, for three quarters, they were the much better team. But when the lead started to slip away, they just lost their composure. Uh, yeah, the Golden footwork, the positioning. Take them to difficult cover inside. his first personal foul. Team score. At the line for the Celtics, Jason Tatum. Two shots. Falls for Tatum. Williams is checked in for Horford. And so Tatum nails both of them. The Warriors have gone 4 of 10, shooting the rock in this first quarter. Right side, Curry. And Pritchard pulls it down. Man, you don't see this fella blow many layups. Not against D like that, anyway. Here's Tatum. Impressive scoring stats with around 27 points a game. They just brushed off the contact right there. I mean, the stronger Tatum gets, the more effective he becomes finishing inside of him. Now Curry. Wiggins outside. Knocks down the triple. He doesn't play around. The buck is there for him. He's going to get it. Watching Wiggins work on offense. I mean, he's one of the few players that can always get a shot. He's often the bailout option for the team. Tice, a screen on Thompson. Here's White, driving to the basket. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Inside, here's Green. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. Wiggins has the quickness and length to create a shot for himself anytime. I saw at the top of the key. Green. Green. Line shot two. clock is winding down. It's always a nice option to have on the floor. First free throw is good. I mean, it's for Draymond. Defense is still his calling card. The versatility to switch one through five, contain, get back, communicate, be in a position to help. He does it all. Looney's checked in for the Warriors. Peyton comes in for Clay Thompson. And so he makes both from the line. And, and you have to admire how Green sees the game. He does his homework on every player. Demands precision from himself and teammates. White. Good. Derek White. Curry with it. Give him eight points now. Beyond the arc. Counted from distance. Curry's got 11. Well, Draymond's a student of the game. And Chris, as you said, he sees so much. Yeah, you love to hear him talk about basketball. He knows the game as well as anyone. I mean, his brain for the game makes him special. Back to White. Five to shoot. For three. It's rebounded by Golden State. Outside Peyton. Oh, 
Pass to Green. To the inside. And Looney with the slam. Love how Green consistently comes to give it up. He's a nightmare to guard the screen. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Tatum. And so it looks like the Celtics will retain possession here. Celtics basketball. And the Warriors making a switch here. Porter Jr.'s checked in. Otto Porter. Warriors on D. It's a five-point game. Tice with the ball. Looney's there. Three on the clock. Pass to Pritchard. From deep. Doesn't go for him. And it's the Warriors taking it the other way. Order the pass to Curry. One twenty-four left in the first quarter here. Here's Peyton. And Pritchard pulls it down. Boston's shooting only 31% to get this game underway. White against Peyton. And you hope this early foul doesn't dissuade his aggressiveness. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? You know, you can't ask for any better defense than that. He responded so fast to the shooter, and it stifled him. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Warriors. The three-pointer has been a major weapon for them in early stages. I mean, they'd be smart to keep moving and working on the perimeter. Also, their passing has been terrific in the first half. They'll be happy with all those assists. And he drops the first. And you talk to anyone about White. Grant, they'll tell you, he's best when he's being assertive. I totally agree. I mean, White can be caught standing around when he's not involved. You want him initiating and pick and roll, and he makes pretty good decisions. Now, he may never be a star, but he's going to give you solid minutes. Bielitsa has checked in for the Warriors. White hits them both. Oh, you can get spoiled watching him at the line. I mean, you just expect him to make every one, every time. Dayton finds Porter. Shoots over Tatum. Rebounded by the Celtics. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. From the arc. Sinks it from distance. Tatum's got nine points. Yeah, yeah, strong from three-point land. Tatum is about a 40% shooter from deep. A great clip. Pass to Looney. Now Porter. Outside Curry. Let's go with a three. Tatum pulls it in. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. Shot clock and game clock. One second differential. Six to shoot. Williams a screen on Porter. Here's Tatum. Can't get the go-ahead bucket. Oh, you expect him to make those. They gotta do more to get a hand in his face next time. Stephen Curry getting it done for the Golden State Warriors. 11 points in the quarter. He's on fire. We'll be right back with you shortly. They're always telling us why we did it, why you should do this, why you should do that. So it's been a lot of learning and also been very exciting uh, for the young players. 
Grant Wiggins seems to be taking that next step. Yes, he is. I mean, the former number one overall pick. With a fresh start, some of that pressure is off. Doesn't have to be a star. His best is good enough. And it's been a pretty even game here after one quarter of play. And from what we've seen here from the Warriors, what's your take so far? It's simple. When you can protect the rim the way they have, it's a big advantage. Showing no mercy right now. The shooters look frustrated seeing so many of their shots get stifled. Clay Thompson is out there with Jordan Poole. Then it's Nemanja Bialica. Then there's Otto Porter. And it's Wiggins in at the four. That's the Warriors five. Brown against Porter. Back to Poole. Knocks it loose. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. Brian, we know that Stephen Curry generally is regarded as the greatest shooter the game has ever known. He said for him, quote, it starts with a great base and foundation and allows everything to feel perfect. The perfect shot feels effortless to me. Serene and quiet. It's only me, the rim, and the basketball. Powerful words from Stephen. It is a thing of beauty, Allie. Excellent. Now that's how you use the screen right there. And it leads to a thunderous finish. That was nice. Yeah, coach is definitely pleased. That's the execution he loves to see. Poole, the pass to Porter. Wiggins with a screen on Brown. Shot clock at six. Golden State needs to get off a shot. And the shot's good. Bielitsa's got his second basket on the night. Like the show of unselfishness from Porter. Wanting to improve as a passer and hit his open teammates. And Clay Thompson picks up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. Green's checked in for the Warriors. Now into the lineup for your Warriors. Bring on Green. Out to the wing. Horford against Bielitsa. Horford passes to Williams. Down five on the shot clock. Horford, a screen on Poole. Late clock. The Celtics got to hurry here. Oh, the go-ahead bucket. No good. The Warriors leading. There's a screen by Bielitsa to the paint. Drops in the layup for two. Bielitsa's got his third bucket of the night. They have no answer defensively inside. Smart against Poole. Horford, a screen on Wiggins. Here's Smart. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. It's going to go on Draymond Green. And I think working himself to the line, an area where Smart really can excel. I mean, he's built for contact. That's for sure. And you can't measure Smart's value by the numbers. He does all the little things. I mean, he gives you toughness, courage, and a sustained effort. for Smart. And what stands out about Smart is how many winning plays he makes, Chris. Could be a shot, a pass, a steal, a crucial rebound. I mean, you want him in there when the game's on the line. Kaminga, he's checked in for Bielica. And so Smart nails them both. And we're seeing teams pick up the pace. Something you set the trend for in Phoenix, Grant. Why do you think that's becoming more prevalent? Great question. I mean, in today's game, we're all about the analytics. And that has shown that you shoot a higher percentage earlier in the shot clock. So it makes sense to push the tempo and see what you can get early. Here's Thompson. Orford pulls it in. Boston trailing. Outside White, Smart outside. Back to White. Horford, a screen on Thompson. Kick out to Brown. The three ball. Ooh, Thompson with the block. Nice aggressive defense from Thompson. Getting it all over the shot and knocking it away. Pass to Green. Back to Poole. 
Here's Kaminga. He's guarded by White. Here's Kaminga. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. White on the wing. Defended by Thompson. And out of bounds. The Warriors will take it. And the box leaders among small forwards. Coaches love to get strong defense out of the wings. Fourth, Andrew Wiggins. And of course, Jason Tatum. These are some of the league's most versatile defenders in this group. I mean, they can mirror ball handlers on the perimeter as well as contest shots in the paint. Uh, yeah, and what it really says about them is that they're able to guard multiple positions now. That is a huge asset for most teams. Wiggins against Brown. Ooh, rejected by Horford. Oh, you can't be careless around Horford. Throw up a weak shot around him. He'll send it back. As the playoffs draw closer, here's what the East looks like. Taking a look at Boston with great effort over a long season. They're second in the conference. Well, for the Celtics, they've been terrific throughout the regular season, showing they may be just the team to beat in the postseason. Pass to Kaminga. Back to Poole. Off the mark, and the drought continues. For Boston, they've got nothing to go out of five attempts so far this quarter. Outside White. Wiggins against Brown. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. That one belongs to Wiggins. And Brown is just an exceptional player. Really love whenever he shows off his athletic. Brown, two shots. He's checked in for Poole. Pritchard's checked in for Boston. And it's tied up with that one. The Warriors have gone three for seven here in the second quarter. Pass to Green. Wiggins outside. Down low. Trying to get back on track. Another shot. Oh, it's blocked by Williams. Smart against Thompson. Smart outside. Here's Pritchard. He's covered by Curry. Pritchard, no good. The Warriors shooting just around 33% since the second quarter got underway. Thompson finds Curry. Wiggins outside. To the middle. Here's Thompson. Ooh, that's got to feel good. That basket makes him one for eight. Okay. Finding the wide open teammate. Nice job by Wiggins to move the ball with purpose. Outside, Brown. Williams with the screen. The drive by Brown, and the shot goes in. Brown's got four points in the quarter. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. All right, it's a lazy effort. Let's just be honest. Hoping the shooter misses, that doesn't constitute defense. Pass to Wiggins. Warford with a steal. Here's Pritchard, defended by Thompson. Crafty move. Ooh, Thompson with the block. Here's Kaminga. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Got a piece of it. The Celtics have gotten only two of eight field goals to go in the second. Smart outside. Now here's Brown. He's closely guarded. Curry against Smart. Clock at six. Going inside. 
And here's a look at some numbers for Kevon Looney. And during the last five games, he's been a force on the boards, really throwing his body at rebounds and trying to grab as many as he can. And that kind of effort has been noticed by his coaches and teammates. So now they lead by one. You know, Smart is one of those guys. I mean, you love him if he's on your team, but truthfully, you hate him if he's not. And the Warriors make some changes. Looney's checked in for Green. Porter Jr. comes in for Wiggins. And Peyton is subbed in for Clay Thompson. And so Smart nails them both. Yeah, just knocking down every free throw. I mean, I love to see this kind of efficiency. Peyton against Smart. The three from Curry. And his fifth basket. Now five for eight. Looking comfortable out there. Oh, I like tonight. Cliff Curry is a must-watch basketball. He's scoring from everywhere. Tatum can't hit. The Warriors have gone just 5 of 12 here in the second quarter. Over to the left wing. Pass to Payton. From deep. Curry, no good. Austin's gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. And looking at the career of Curry, his legacy is set. The titles, records, numbers all cemented him as a legend. Golden State has gone one of two from downtown here in the second. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. At times, some have doubted Curry's legacy. Hard to make a case against him, though, in my opinion. I agree, B.A. He has produced in every capacity. It's just a matter of how great he is. One of the top three point guards of all time. That free throw misses. And the Warriors making a switch here. Bielitsa's checked in. And he sinks the second. Here's Pritchard. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Williams, a screen on Curry. And Pritchard, here we go. The shot, no good. So Golden State will take it the other way. Bielita, the pass to Curry. Golden State. And now let's check out some of the point guards who have been lighting up the scoreboard. Stephen Curry, third. <laughs> you know, this is a collection of maybe the most well-rounded offensive talents in the league. These guys aren't there just to run the offense for the teams anymore. They are the offense. They can light it up. The first free throw is good. And so Tatum nails both of them. Well, the Warriors shooting around 39%. They'd like to get that higher. 125 left in the second period. Now here's Curry. The D's right on him. And Bielitsa, good for three. Bielitsa's got nine points in the quarter. Now this is Bielitsa's game. He's ready to fire as soon as the ball hits his hands. Here's Pritchard. He's covered by Curry. To the left wing. Six to shoot. Tatum driving in. Great D that time from Porter. He has shot them in the foot with his inability to make shots tonight. 
Tatum against Payton. Elita outside. Outside Porter. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. A superb athlete. I mean, you got to respect how Porter uses Porter. his long strides to get these calls. Auto Porter taking two shots. That's good from Porter. You know, the versatility of Porter is huge. I mean, he's an outstanding perimeter defender, in addition also to being a proven scorer. And that's good as he hits both shots. I love it. In attack mode. Drawing foul calls this quarter and getting to the free throw line. Seven second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Tatum from long range. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. You gotta love how they've been crashing the boards. Fighting hard for every miss. Here's Curry. And that bucket makes him six for ten in the contest. They're punishing those late defensive rotations. Getting good looks inside throughout the half. Tatum drives in. Count that bucket. Tatum's got 13. Once Tatum is around, the contact is over. A little room and all he needed to score. And the first half comes to a conclusion in a game that's been very close so far. The Warriors on top, leading by five. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Guys, thanks. Andrew, this team has set the tone at the defensive end. What's working for you? Uh, we just got after it. You know, it's the main thing, you know, we just try to make them uncomfortable, test everything, and, you know, we were converting on the other side. It's all about the effort. Back to you. Thanks, Allie. After the break, we'll see you right back here to begin quarter number three. Welcome, everyone, as we dig into the details, things working out so far for the Golden State Warriors. Well, if you compare the assist numbers, you can see who's been the superior team, Ernie. And they're playing a much better brand of basketball. That bodes well for them the rest of the way. Let's move on to see what's coming up on the schedule. Glad you could join us. Ryan Anderson and crew are ready to take it away for the start of the third quarter. We've got second half action for you. And if the next couple of quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. Stephen Curry having a dominant impact in this game. He's hit shot after shot from deep. He's so locked in right now. Oh, man, what a tremendous first half. Okay, obviously he's feeling the flow, and he's looking to keep it going. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard. So the Celtics five right now. At the two and the three, Brown and Tatum. Robert Williams out there with Al Horford. And it's smart in at the point. And here's Thompson for three. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Curry. Curry's got three assists tonight. They've been pretty lax with their perimeter defense, giving up a lot of three-pointers. Smart passes to Tatum. Pass to Horford. The kick to Tatum. Shoots over Thompson. And too long on the shot. Their strong work ethic has been evident on the glass. Really getting after it and being physical. And here's Poole. It's blocked by Williams. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Williams. Let's take another look at the staunch defense during that mobile one block. Oh, now that was a block. Some much needed energy there to jumpstart them back into this game. Oh. 
And Marcus Boston Smart foul. picks up the foul. That's his first foul. His first he drops foul. yet another dime. Just foul. facilitating this offense like a maestro. And the defense of Wiggins, Grant, something that he's turned around in his career. Yeah, you know, B.A., he went from a weak defender to a strong one. He's always had the tools, but he's putting it all together and can now be a lockdown wing. Free throw drops for Wiggins. There are fans that hate on Draymond Green, but nobody can deny he's a winner. I mean, he is a winner. He's found success at every level. He gives everything to the team, and of course, he has the rings to talk all he wants. Oh, with great physical and athletic tools, Brown's adept at pushing past contact. Smart against Curry. Green with a screen on Smart. Here's Curry. Some solid defense from Williams. Oh, gritty defense. Protecting the rim at all costs against a guy who has all sorts of ways to finish. Smart against Curry. Shot clock at six. Releases from 15. Rebounded by Green. I'll tell you what, they've been aggressive and they've been physical. Here's Wiggins and misses it off the right side of the rim. The Celtics have gone just one of three in the second half. Outside, Brown. Pass to Smart. Banked it in off the glass. Smart has got eight points. Just too physical, smart, shedding the defense and finishing strong. Curry against Smart. Thompson outside. Wiggins passes to Curry. Over Smart. And there's Curry. All the assists by Wiggins. Wiggins got three assists in the game. Horford left side. With the fadeaway. The Warriors pull it in. Curry's got four rebounds in the game. Wiggins finds Curry. Pass to Thompson. Puts up a three. Another three for Golden State. This defense is getting spaced out. Three of the last five buckets have come from way beyond the arc. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Tatum passes to Smart. Inside. Horford can't hit. The Warriors have gotten four of seven shots to drop in the third. Up top, Curry. Pass to Green. Smart against Poole. Thompson outside. Over Tatum. Thompson's shot is off. He's been off the mark, but somehow he hasn't held them back as a team. Smart passes to Horford. To the wing, right side. Tatum from long range. The shot comes out, so Golden State will take it the other way. And you have to think that they're leading this game because of how they've controlled the boards tonight. Kaminga, he's checked in for the Warriors. And the Celtics also making a change. White, he's checked in for Smart. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Thanks, Brian. The Warriors are trying to get back to the top of the Western Conference. Stephen Curry said, quote, it's tough. Guys want to outperform and exceed expectations. Nobody is content just being middle of the road. It's a challenge we all need to take head on. Yeah, they're trying to bring it all together, Allie. Thank you. Brown passes to White. Screen by Horford. Can they get it? Oh, Green with a block. And good anticipation by Draymond. I mean, he always gets in position for these clean swats like this. Pass to Wiggins. Poole against Williams to the middle. Here's Green. And no good. Good work defensively by White. Boston's shooting only 27% for today's game. Brown can't hit. Golden State has gotten all three from downtown so far in the second half. Poole finds Wiggins. They set the pick. 
Ooh, rejected by Horford. Well, there's the shot clock violation. So they'll turn it over, and the Warriors make some changes. Looney's checked in for Green. Porter Jr. comes in for Wiggins. And Peyton is subbed in for Thompson. And here's Boston. Down by 15. Tice outside. Pass to White. Here's Pritchard. He's guarded by Porter. Five on the clock. A shot to stop the drought! The kick out to Williams. Second shot opportunity, and White lays it in. White's got eight points. Check out the handles. A spin move like that is how you lose the nearest defender. Now here's Poole. You know, his stats have been solid, averaging around 18 and a half points a game. And that's out of bounds. Golden State will retain possession. Golden State basketball. All right, let's use this time to see some real stats, real scores from the real NBA, and see the teams with the best rebounding numbers this season. Fifth best, the Celtics. This team has done a great job of hitting the boards, and they do tremendous work boxing out. Oh, it's stolen by Tice. Drive by Brown. And the jam by Brown. You can't teach that Brown just showing off his incredible dunking ability. Oh, a great look there. Brought to you by the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. And here's Poole. Pass to Looney. Over Tice. And the Warriors miss again. Boston's shooting about 31% here in quarter number three. Brown with it. There's the triple. Another miss by Brown. On the wing, Porter. Defended by Brown. Now here's Looney. Left side, Porter. Poole outside. Takes a three. It's hauled in by White. Boston's gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Here's Brown. Had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. You know what a kind of competitor he is? I know he's upset with his performance and with the score. Here's Poole. Rebounded by the Celtics. It's been a really tough quarter for him. I mean, he cannot get his shots to drop. His bad night from the field is only going to get worse if he keeps throwing up shots like that. Pass to Porter. Back to Poole. Into the lane. Hauled in by Brown. Brown's got four rebounds in the game. His scoring has not been there at all tonight. I mean, it tells you a lot about their team, that they have the lead in. Golden State has gone three of four from outside in the second half. Porter with it. He's picked up by Tice. We've seen Tice amongst the lead leaders in blocks. I mean, he's not a player you can test too much. And the Warriors making a switch here. The elites has checked in. Celtics on D. 11 point game. And the Warriors miss again. Pass to Pritchard. Williams a screen on Poole. And Pritchard, here we go. No good there. That would have cut it to single digits. And the Warriors shooting just 26% on the third. Here's Poole. Misses, and the dry spell continues. This has not been his best quarter. Oh, just off his game, forcing a few shots, not letting the game come to him naturally. Williams with the screen. White can't hit. The Warriors shooting only 35% so far. White against Poole. There's 45 seconds left in the third quarter. Out to the right wing. Six on the shot clock. 
Outside for Bielita. Pass to Porter from behind the arc. Oh, wow. Drew the contact, and that three almost went in. So he'll go to the line for three free throws. Third team foul. I mean, well, look, Porter is an athletic player, someone who forces contact on his way up. Otto Porter taking three shots. That free throw, no good. Stephen Curry, he's checked in for Poole. He hits the second from the line. Their lead could be even bigger right now, but their efficiency from the line has dropped off a little. You know, if you put Marcus Smart in a power forward's body, it might be Grant Williams. Williams is physical. He's personal, willing to make the sacrifice. He's got some Draymond and some P.J. Tucker. Good ingredients for a successful career. Seven second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Here's Peyton. Some solid defense from Williams. It's not easy to finish in traffic, but those are chances he has to convert. And here's Brown for three. And so it's the Golden State Warriors ending the quarter up 10. Their defensive efforts have paid off, effectively shutting down the opposing offense. And more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way right after this. it's time to bring up the State Farm assist to the game. Now, I know he's a big man, but he's got some point guard in him if he's making passes like this. This is where the NBA's headed. I mean, multi-dimensional big men. That was just a beautiful pass. Fourth quarter action is upon us. Thanks, as always, for joining us. Murray and Thompson are the one and the two. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Nemanja Bielica. And it's Green in at the center position, locking down the middle. That's the Warriors' five. It's Wiggins on the wing. Shoots over Tatum. Knocked loose. Sometimes it's just not your night. Fortunately, his teammates have picked up the slack. Pass to White. Horford, a screen on Thompson. Oh, Green with a block. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Green. Celtics basketball. Kaminga, he's checked Celtics in for the Warriors. The Celtics also with a sub. Williams is checked in. Here's Smart. Shot clock at six. Pass to Horford. Fires the three. Oh, rejected by Wiggins. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Here's Curry. And we played through about a minute here in the fourth. Here's the three. Ooh, rejected by Horford. He had it flowing from long range in the first half. Not sure what changed. The perimeter game has failed him thus far. Hit one from range in the first half, but nothing since. Boston has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. White, the pass to Smart. Now 
There's the drive. Oh, Green with a block. And he gets it back. Here's Williams. And the shot falls short that time. That's a nice defensive effort. Sticking right up on him. Affecting the shot. Tries again. And the nice bucket inside from Wiggins. Wiggins. And the Warriors lead by 12. Yeah, showing a little versatility with their offensive attack. Boston. In the first half, it was about the three ball. In the second half, they've emphasized interior scoring. Fans, the loudest section is three t-shirts. Is it you? Let me hear you. Look who's coming out onto the court. Get up on your feet and welcome your Warriors tenth team. here to catch up with Allie from the sideline. Hey guys, the head coach of the Celtics had some instruction for his guys during the break. He let his guys know that he needs more from them to close this deficit. He said, quote, we have to get something started. I know we're behind, but you are capable of taking this game if you still want it. All right, Allie, thanks once again. Now smart. Pass to Tatum. Tries to break his ice. And he lays it up and in. This is where the craftiness and length come in. I mean, Tatum makes a lot of tough shots with defenders on. Curry passes to Thompson. Off target from outside. The Celtics have got one out of six shots to fall in this final quarter. Not ideal. Smart outside. There's the three. Here's Williams. And a miss there with a Boston chance to cut foul. the lead to single digits. Robert and Robert Williams picks up That's the foul. foul. That's foul number two for him. Team foul. Golden State has gone 0 for 3 here in the fourth. Smart against Curry. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. This is his first turnover game. He's been making good decisions out there. Now into the lineup for your Warriors. And the Warriors making a switch here. Pools checked in. The Celtics shooting a rough 25% for the field in this game. Smart finds Horford. Pass to White. Out to Horford. Just four to shoot. Here's Smart. Off the mark. Had a chance there to trim it to single digits. Wiggins passes to Curry. Thompson against White. Now here's Thompson. Defense right on him. Williams grabs the board. Williams has got four rebounds now. Smart passes to Williams. Back to Smart. The three is up. Nails it from beyond the arc. Showing his range. Smart spacing the floor. Curry against Smart. Curry passes to Poole. 
Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. Outside White. Pass to Horford. Now here's Smart, hounded by Wiggins. A little mid-range shot is up, and it's Smart missing. They know they can't give him that shot. The D's are over it, not even giving him an inch of space. Thompson, a screen on Tatum. And here is Thompson, over White, and it comes off the front of the rim. Smart passes to White. Now Tatum. Pass to Horford. That falls. Nice feed that time from Tatum. And it's now only a five-point Warrior lead. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Now a timeout called by Golden State. Things just aren't going their way. He clearly wants to talk it over. Well, the defensive intensity has to pick up, and I'm sure Coach is going to let them know that. I can't hear you. Make some noise! Look who's coming out onto the court. Get up on your feet and welcome your Warriors, Dance team. Here. Brown's checked in. Wiggins finds Poole. Thompson outside. Pure from three-point range. Strange game for him. He hasn't made any noise in the first half, and here in the second, he's been everywhere. Smart passes to Horford. Brown, a screen on Wiggins. That's tipped. It's stolen by Green. Oh, and a fast break for the Warriors. Pass to Wiggins. Shoots over Brown. Wiggins, no good. Boston's gotten just one of their four threes to go here in the fourth quarter. Up top, Tatum. Hounded by Wiggins. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. That one belongs to Wiggins. All right, guys, some stats here. The scoring breakdown for the Warriors. They base their offense two. around the three-point shot today, and that was the right move. It's been a huge weapon for them all game. And they've really displayed a sharp passing game tonight as well. A lot of well-timed assists out there. And that one falls for Tatum. So Tatum nails both of them. 
Here's Curry. Outside, Green. It's Poole on the wing. Thompson outside. Over Williams. Thompson's shot is off. Boston trailing. Smart with the ball. Back to Brown. Over Green. Boston no good that time either. And the Warriors shooting just 31% in today's game. Not great. Here's Curry. Pass to Poole. Now here's Thompson. Just five on the clock. Over Tatum. Rebound Boston. Horford's got ten rebounds here tonight. So active. Poole against Brown. Looking to get back on track. Chalk up two there. <laughs> this run has been fueled by their Matador defense. Golden State has gone one for five from downtown here in the fourth. Thompson outside. Green in the post. Working on Williams. Green the pass to Curry. Green with a screen on Smart. Thompson outside. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Curry. Thompson's got 15 points here in the second half. Their strategy has been pretty simple here in the second half. Attack from three-point range. Look, with a hat trick these days, you need to stretch the floor somewhat to make everything else work. Down low. Ooh, rejected by Horford. And it's out of bounds. The Warriors able to retain possession here. They've got time on their side here, Grant. And if they're smart, they'll milk the clock a little. Here's Curry. Okay, great contest right there by Smart. Perhaps the premier defensive guard in this game. With the drive. And it's cleared by Stephen Curry. Golden State has gone two of six so far in the fourth. 121 left in the fourth quarter here. Thompson passes to Curry. From outside, off the mark. So it's Boston now. They've given up just eight points in the fourth. Pass to Horford. And here's Smart. He's covered by Curry. Brown passes to Tatum. Takes the three. The shot no good. And Golden State will come the other way. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Here's Thompson. Driving inside, and it's good. Assisting on the play was Curry. And the Warriors lead by nine. And look, he's surprisingly agile at dribble. Thompson cutting right to the court of deep with his hand. And the craziest get free t shirt. Tell us what you got, fans. Look who is coming out of the court. You have on your feet and welcome the Warriors 15. Look here. Looney's checked in for Green. Bielita comes in for Wiggins. Porter Jr., he's checked in for Clay Thompson. And Peyton is subbed in for Poole.
There's 39 seconds left in the fourth. Here's Brown. The Elitza with some nice D. Now the Warriors with it. They've got a nine-point lead. Peyton's shot is good. This is what winning is all about. Playing your best when it matters most. This is what guys play for. And when it pans out Gary like this, is a great fit. And you have to love the focus. He gets hit, foul. but converts it anyway. Shooting for Boston, Jalen Brown. Shooting one. Here's Curry. And so it's Golden State winning this one. Even early on in this game, they appeared happy to be playing at home. And it makes a huge difference. Once they started to get into a groove, you never really felt like they wouldn't come out on top. All right, let's go courtside to Allie LaForce with our player of the game. Allie, it's all yours. I'm here now with Clay Thompson. And Clay, congratulations on the win. How satisfying is it winning games in front of this devoted crowd? Well, we always want to put on a show for our fans. They deserve it. They show up every single night. And uh, it's just fun to protect home court. One of the best places to play in the league, no doubt. Thanks, Clay. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Thanks for that. And that'll do it, folks. For Chris Weber, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, I'm Brian Anderson. Thank you for tuning in to watch the NBA on 2K Sports. Now it's time to present our New Balance player of the game, Stephen Curry.